not knowing the things that shall befall me there. Right. Save that the Holy Spirit witnessed in every city, saying that bounds and afflictions abide me. Right. So a spirit testified, man. All right. That bonds, men in chains, and afflictions, right, catching hell, is waiting on Paul when he go to Jerusalem. But Pete, what he said, keep reading, brother. But none of these things move me. Oh, huh? What? Read that again, brother. Huh. But none of these things move me. Paul said, that didn't bother me, man. Why? Keep reading, brother. Neither count I my life dear unto myself. Paul said, I don't, I don't care about my life, man. But why was this man so fervent like that in the spirit, man? Okay, why would he say such things like that, man? When bonds and death waiting on him, man, this man said, that didn't even move me. Showing that, showing that the apostles, man, they, bro, that was, bro, that was, these were some highly spiritual men. They saw your how was shot, man. Okay, that's why they wasn't terrified by anything, man. All right? They saw the Lord raised from the dead, man. Okay, for 40 days. You telling me that they saw this man for 40 days straight? You think that they gonna deny him? All right, you think some little beating or something will stop them? Devil will stop them? That shouldn't stop them, bro. Because they saw the Lord, man. That's why they suffered them death like that, man. Okay? All of them died horrible except uh, John, man. Right, keep reading, brother. Hmm. So that I might finish my course with joy. Read it again from the top, brother. Done. This is Ooh. Acts 20, verse 24. Right. But none of th these things move, move me. Right. Neither count I my life dear unto myself. Right. So that I might finish my course with joy. Right. And the ministry which I have received of the Lord Yahweh shine. Right. To testify the gospel of the grace of the Most High Yahweh. Paul said that it moved me because what? So that I can finish my course huh. and the ministry, man. Paul wanted to fulfill his life, man. Okay, make sure that he did what the Lord told him for the do, man. Okay? Because Paul could have just said, shit, I ain't going to Jerusalem, bro. I don't want to go through that shit, bro. I'm gonna, shit, I'm going to go to, I'm going to go to India. I don't know, somewhere, you know, you, you know, so trying to escape his uh, uh, service, man. No. Paul said, look, that ain't, look, I ain't worried about getting my ass beat, man. All right? Because I don't care about dying, man. Paul said, I don't care about dying. Because I need to finish my course because I know that the Lord Yahweh Shai going to raise me back up again anyway. Okay? He understood that the kingdom, man, and this gospel was way more important than his own life. And that's the mentality that we got to have, man. And that's not easy, bro. Okay? That's not something that, that, that you develop overnight, man. That take time, man. Okay? I'm still trying to grow in the spirit, man. I ain't look. I need to look. I just need a little small hair string of the faith that of the, the faith that Apostle Paul had, man. My faith is nowhere near that yet, man. Okay, but it, but that's why you got to keep fighting, man. Right? You 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 gonna finish with that, right? Come. All right, all right. I get that one time. Ask twenty one, and then uh, I'll be able to follow like Baby Cole did. Come. Just ask uh, twenty one and uh, eight. Eight. Right. Uh, ask twenty one and eight. And the next day, we that were of Paul's company departed and came unto uh, Caesarea. Caesarea, and we entered into the house of Philip, the evangelist, which was one of the seven, and abode with him. Right. And the same man had four daughters, virgins, which did prophesy. Uh, kind. And as we tarried, tarried there many days, there came down from Judea a certain prophet named Agabus. Mm -hmm. And when he uh, was come unto us, he took Paul's girdle and bound his own hand and feet and said, Thus said the Holy Spirit, so shall the Jew, Jews at Jerusalem bind the man that oweth the, this girdle. So like it, that own it, this girdle, right? And shall deliver him into the hands of the Gentiles. Boom. So there was Paul's girdle, and he came and bound Paul with his own girdle, right? It says, bound his what? Bound his his hands, all right? And his feet, it said, 
said, thus said the Spirit, this is going to happen to you, and you're going to be delivered unto the Gentiles. But people, Paul said back in Acts 20, Paul said, I, I ain't worried about that. But people, what he's going to say in this one, though, right? Can you read? Verse 12. <clears throat> and when and when he and when we heard these things, both we and they of that place besought him not to go up to Jerusalem. They're like, now nah, Paul, look, bro, please do not go to Jerusalem, man. All right, because if you go to Jerusalem, they're gonna kill you, man. Okay? Please don't go, Paul. But people what Paul said, man. Right, keep reading, brother. Then Paul answered, What mean ye to weep? And to break my heart. Oh, like, hold on, man. Hold on. Hold on. Don't, 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 no. Nah. Don't do all that, man. Paul said, no, nah, don't, don't, no, nah, look, look. Uh, they don't need to feel sorry, man. All right, keep reading. For I am ready not to be bound only. Paul said, I'm not only, look, I am not, he said, for I am, for I am ready, for I am. For I am ready not to be bound not, only. Yeah, Paul said, look, I'm not only ready to go to jail. Right, keep reading. But also to die at Jerusalem for the name of the Lord Yahweh Shah. Paul said, I'm ready to die. He said, I'm ready to die for the Lord, for the name of Yahweh Shah, bro. This man, read, look, but the apostle Paul was a true servant of Yahweh Bash and Yahweh Shah and all the apostles were, man. This, this, this man said, look, I'm ready to die, man. Now, now some people say that he's crazy. This man must be crazy. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Yeah. He told me he told he told me he ready to go to jail and die. Take me to jail, throw away the key. Right? right? right. This man was bold in your house, shot because he didn't give a damn about death, man. This man was bold and was fervent for the Lord. This is how we gotta be, man. But uh, that take times, man. Alright? Because the apostle Paul was a special case, man. Okay, right? Keep reading, brother. God, this is uh verse 14. Right? And when he would not be persuaded. Right, they were trying to persuade Paul. Like, Paul, come on, man. Please, bro. Don't even, don't, please don't do it, Paul. Paul couldn't be persuaded, man. All right? All right? That man had a one-track mind. <laughs> and that would have served you how about you how shot, man. Right? Keep reading. We cease saying the will of the Lord be done. Because, because that was the will of the Heavenly Father to make sure Paul do his duty, man. All right? The Spirit testified that he was going to he going to get bound, he going to go to jail, and he going to die. Paul said, look, I'm ready to do all that. Now what? This man was bold in the spirit, man. But you got to read these, that's why you got to read, man. You got to read to gain confidence, man. To have that same hope, bro. Because our time is coming, man. Okay? Our, look, our time is coming, bro. So, Lord willing, man, I hope this, um, Open form of edifying to you, brothers and sisters, man. We're going to give our praise and glory to, to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shah, Ba'ashem, Rukhah, HaKadash. Double honor to the apostles and elders of great millstone. Peace and salutation to the elect brethren. Shalom. Shalom.